Beautiful, striking and appealing, but be absolutely sure you know what you're taking on when you get a Hosky. John Doxbury and his dog Kaya are inseparable, but that's not always the case. John has been running the Sibes and Sled Dogs Hosky Rescue Centre near Nelson for a year. He's over 38 dogs in his care now because a bored Hosky can wreak havoc if left home alone. My friend had new central heating fitted with uh, plastic pipes. Well, when he came back, the house was flooded. They'd absolutely chewed through the pipes. Door casings coming off, skirtings coming off. These husky owners know exactly what's involved in providing the best life possible for their pets. Simply put, you only get out what you put in. There is no doubt they are truly amazing dogs. They've got characters all of their own, but they're not the easiest dogs to look after. And you've got to have a lot of patience. A lot of patience and very, very good ears. And that, that right? The reality is they get to eight months, they turn into pulling machines. You've got to buy special equipment to, to, to walk the dogs and you can't have them off lead. They're a bit like a coiled spring. As soon as you let them off lead, kabush, they've gone. John's rightly passionate about his rescue centre and has often jumped into his car to travel hundreds of miles to save huskies who were within hours of being put down. He says they're great dogs, but potential owners should know what's involved. The problem is they don't research the breed. They don't realise what the dogs turn into. With a bit of education, and we can educate them into staying in an home rather than rehoming. I'd say join my group, see the reality of owning an husky, and then tell me a week later after being on the group that you want to have an husky. Yes, they are. They, they are. You know, we can put them in a domestic situation, but you've got to uh, live your lifestyle round the dog. The dog won't change its lifestyle for you. If you live in a block of flats, my advice, get a potted plant instead. Paul Croner, ITV News, Nelson.